Now our final match of the night. And the final match of the fifth annual National High School Wrestling Championships, the heavyweight final. And pacing the mat right now, you see our contestant from Indiana, Andy Schneider. And joining him now in the blue singlet from Ohio, Jeremy Tate. A pair of two-time state champions and two wrestlers who have been undefeated two years in a row, so something's got to give here. This should be a good one. Andy Schneider in the maroon from Mount Vernon High School. As we said, a two-time state champion. Jeremy Tate from Newark, Ohio, Licking Valley High School, a two-time state champion in Division II. Schneider, four matches, four pins to this point. Tate has two pins, and a major decision, and a regular decision. by Jeremy Tate. Schneider initiated, threw it up and tried to come inside, threw the arm up, tried to come inside, basically slipped a bit. Tate coming up with the two points. But that's part of this game, capitalizing on mistakes. Schneider trying to sit out. Two to nothing, the early lead for Jeremy Tate of Ohio, Licking Valley High School in Newark. And now trying to tilt, and he's got it. Back points coming for Jeremy Tate of Ohio. And two of them, four to nothing lead. That's a dangerous weapon, a heavyweight with good tilts. And another tilt. And another two points, as now Schneider gets the stand up. Almost had the hands broken, but not quite. They'll take it back to the center with 26 seconds left in this first period. Quick six to nothing lead for Jeremy Tate. Schneider again with the stand up. Almost out. Now he's got the wizard. They'll bring it back to the center with 16 seconds left. A pair of two-time state champions, two-time undefeated state champions. Jeremy Tate from Ohio on top with the six to nothing lead. Andy Schneider of Indiana in the maroon. Now we see a little bit of why Tate got here and we'll have to see what Schneider does. One period in the books here, and Tate leads six to nothing as Schneider defers. Tate will take the bottom, and we'll see for the first time what Andy Schneider can do on top. And a spin out by Tate, and he catches Schneider on his back for two and more. And quickly 10 to nothing, and another tilt try by Tate. And boy, Tate's been dynamite on top. Yes, he has. Works those tilts real nice. Another tilt. And it's gonna be two more points, 12 to nothing lead. He gets a three point near fall, this match is over. A stall warning against Schneider. 
I think that's one thing we saw was a lot of consistency with the stalling, Rob. They've, they've been pretty good with that across the board. All the officials, they've been nailing it pretty early. They want to see the action move. Certainly want to prevail upon both wrestlers to improve their positions at all times. As now we see Tate looking for something else on top. He leads 12 to nothing. Less than a minute left to go in the second period. You know, I'm sure there's a lot of times that that bottom man wants to just tell the referee, how would you like to be down here with this guy mauling you on top? A stalling point and two points and a technical ball. 15 to nothing at 319 for Jeremy Tate of Ohio. I believe he, he got about 10 of those points on those tilts. He did it on the mat. Very tough to stop with that tilt. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, please stay with us for the final award. The fourth champion for Ohio. And boy, they were dominating in these finals. Yes, they were. Following the heavyweight awards, all champions report to the middle of the mat in your seat of warm-up. Top to bottom, please. Jeremy Tate, the heavyweight champion of the nation. Jeremy, a great display of wrestling. Thanks a lot. I wouldn't, that last match here, I figured it'd be a little tougher than what it was because I was expecting good distance. I'm going to try to save a little energy towards the end and win it there towards the end. But I come out to a great lead and just build on it. Describe some of the, the moves you used tonight. Most of my back points were chalked up on a two on one tilt. I started to move probably last year, two years ago. And it's worked for me great in heavyweight, just two on one tilt. Seems like you get back two count before they realize that their back's exposed. It's just how I chalked them up. Congratulations. The fourth champion from Ohio for this tournament, Jeremy Tate. Thanks.